Hello at Excel students, we're in paper one and paper two. We continue now with the 10 marker. This 10 marker will say assess something, assess something. The mark breakdown, uh, knowledge application analysis in total six marks, two, 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 marked in levels and your evaluation now worth four marks, but now marked in levels. Unlike the eight marker, the eight mark, you just have to state evaluation points. You accumulate marks with ticks in evaluation on the eight, not now on the 10, four marks, but marked in levels. So basically you need to write in greater depth here, just stating evaluation ideas, won't cut it. So both are marked in levels, analysis and evaluation. This question will come in section B of paper one and paper two only. So you will have extracts to guide you with application. Good to know, this is a short essay. You're not supposed to overdo it. You're not supposed to go overblown with your writing here. 10 minutes will be more than enough for what is a very simple short essay. When it comes to structure, all you need to do is write two paragraphs. You're looking for one detailed analysis paragraph or KAA if that's how you like to consider it. One detailed KAA or analysis paragraph will be absolutely fine. And now one detailed evaluation paragraph. Remember that in section B, it's not the number of points that matter, it's the depth of your writing that matters. So if you try and overdo it, you write two, three, four analysis paragraphs, you're just wasting your time. That's not what cuts it, that's not what matters, that's not what examiners are looking for. They're looking for depth of writing, not the number of points that you write. So one analysis paragraph will be absolutely fine as long as you write that in depth. One evaluation paragraph written in depth would absolutely suffice and that will get you your four marks. So when it comes to your two paragraphs, your first one is your analysis paragraph. Now, of course, you're looking to write in full depth, whatever point you're making or policy that you're writing, you're writing about it in proper depth. You're developing the idea in as much detail as you possibly can. You're looking for application, crucial in section B. You're always applying. Where do you get that from? The extracts, all the examples, the application that you need will be in the extracts. So integrate that within your analysis, within your writing. And then we're always thinking diagram, right? Anytime you're writing an economics essay, you're writing a paragraph, we're always thinking, could there be a diagram that I could draw to illustrate the point I'm writing? Sometimes the answer is no, in which case don't worry about it. Don't force a diagram if it's not naturally relevant, if it doesn't naturally illustrate what you're writing. But if there is a diagram which illustrates what you're writing, you draw it. Just make sure you label your diagram, make sure you refer to your diagram in your writing and then you get full credit. So always just think diagram, but depth of analysis and application is crucial there. And then one detailed evaluation paragraph. You make an evaluation point and then you develop it in as much detail as you possibly can. Depth of evaluation, crucial. Again, you look for application, use the extracts to guide you with application and you'll be set. Again, naturally thinking, is there a diagram that can illustrate the point you're making here? Same caveat as what I said before. So that's it, that will be more than enough. Sometimes this 10 marker will say assess two things two factors, two reasons, two policies. It might say it says two of something, in which case you need another analysis paragraph, a second one. But generally speaking, 90% of the time it's just assess something. So this structure will work brilliantly. Remember, it's not the number of points that you write, it's the depth of writing that's crucial. In 10 minutes, this is very, very doable. Let's move on now. Let's talk about the 12 marker. See you in the next video.